This is Hal Jordan from the Zan Draco Network coming to you semi live with a very important public service announcement. The dangers of wealth and capitalism. Bom bom bom. Today we present to you two subjects. Both excel academically and have worked hard their entire collegiate careers. However, one has access to money and one does not. Both Chad and Romeo were accepted into a prestigious uh, program. However, sadly for Chad, he has bills to pay and cannot accept an unpaid internship. Hey, Romeo uh, has uh, resources. I, job and, uh, I was wondering if you can let me borrow some money right now so I can pay for rent. Oh, okay. Awesome. Thank you. I got dinner tonight. Uh-oh. It looks like Chad has been pulled over. Looks like he's going to be going away for a little while without a fancy lawyer to protect him. Romeo, on the other hand, can afford a lawyer with his mother's money and has the best legal defense money can buy. I object. My client was in the south of France at the time. Not guilty! Chad spends his nights at home paying bills and doing other work. He drinks coffee and lots of it. He doesn't have time to go out and socialize. Romeo has money and hits the club. He buys lots of alcohol and spends his time with questionable company. Chad enjoys good wholesome activities, like reading. He spends most of his free time borrowing books from the local public library. He doesn't have money for nice, expensive new things. Good job, citizen! Romeo has plenty of money for new video game systems and wastes his time in idleness. Not having enough money for groceries and proper nutrition, Chad mostly eats frozen vegetables and french fries. Lots and lots of french fries. Romeo, on the other hand, has money for nutritious food and can maintain a healthy diet filled with vegetables and yogurt. Chad is sick, but he can't go to a doctor with all of their co-pays and fees? No, you'll just have to hope he heals on his own. Sir, I don't know how to tell you this, but... Whenever Romeo feels ill, he immediately goes to the doctor. Tuberculosis, West Nile virus, influenza, black lung... I could go on. What? Well, what I'm saying is that if you make full use of the amazing American healthcare system, you will quite possibly live forever. So as we conclude the tale of Chad and Romeo, we see the powerful effect of money. Romeo, having access to his mother's capital, was able to take full access of his unpaid internship and the health and nutritional benefits that came along with it. However, he also had access to the corrupting power of video games and alcohol. Chad, however, he got no time for alcohol and video games, having to keep on top of his studies and bills. Money can be a corrupting force. Be warned.